Good morning, good morning. Happy, happy Saturday. It's Saturday. Um, it's not too good of a Saturday here in New York City. It's kind of crappy. We had a big rainstorm. I think the rainstorm happened between during the night and early hours of the morning. I don't know. I was asleep. So I woke up to a flood out in the yard. <laughs> and, and that's okay. Um, so let me start this video. It's going to be a review for a product in which I purchased. Hold your applause. Um, let me do the disclaimer first. In no way, shape, or form am I sponsored, endorsed, or ambassadored by any of the companies in which I speak about. I solely speak about them from the goodness of my heart. I share them with you, my YouTube community, who I also consider my faraway friends. In no way am I affiliated with any content creators or vloggers of any kind. Thank you so much. Um, just wanted to get that out of the way. Now, I had previously seen online and there was talk about the new Haunted Mansion collection that was being released by Disney. And now they're released on Shop Disney, which I know it's the Disney store, but I still call it Shop Disney, okay? Um, it was gonna be released on July 8th, also through the Disney parks and online. This is what I was told. Okay, fine, go on Shop Disney on 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on July 8th, from the 7th going into July 8th, which would be past midnight. We good hardcore Disney fans usually do this okay they Disney usually releases their products around 3 or 4 a.m. on their websites depending on your time zone my time zone is 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time uh, unfortunately the cup was not released at that time in that they said it was supposed to be released on the 8th now it was that just released for the parks I have no idea they did not release this cup until July 9th late afternoon my friend called me to tell me that's cool that's fine and then I gave the news to other people because when I found out, I let you guys know. Okay, fine. The cup retails for $44.99. It is the new Starbucks Haunted Mansion Edition cup. Tumbler, should I say. It is a cold tumbler. Okay, I, I wouldn't use it for hot, but it's a cold tumbler. And that's fine. Uh, my husband said, are you going to take the plunge? I said, I have not purchased anything since 2022 off of Shop Disney. Okay, it's just my thing. So I did, I did. Now it came in a timely matter. They sent me the tracking number not three to four days after I made my purchase. Now usually with Shop Disney, maybe they're doing something a little bit different, I have no idea. Um, but usually it takes about a week to a week and a half before they even gave you the tracking number. I know, because I've ordered a lot of stuff over the years. Okay. So this was pretty fast, I give you that. $44.99 with tax and shipping came out to like 58 bucks close to 60 bucks for a 44 dollar cup but that is what you do you know you, you you know if you're in it you're in it you know so i took that plunge only to find out that upon it being mailed to me it wouldn't be disney not to pull this shop disney decides that they're gonna probably throw a wrench and they wound up putting items on sale on their websites 25 percent off the haunted mansion collection that just came out happens to be in that category of 25 percent off i've never seen that happen before but i could sure as hell i sure as hell could guarantee i know why i'm just gonna leave that there because many people have been frowning upon certain things that I've been saying. Listen, I'm going to come out and say it anyway. If you don't want to hear it, that's fine. That's your choice. No problem. But you already know my reasons for me saying what I say. And I back that up because I have been, you know, I find out the information. This is the reason why I repeat it to you is because I know the information is coming from a good source for me. It's out there, folks. You can find it if you want the information. I'll let you know. But if you don't want to know, when I post something, that's fine. Okay? It is as, I am as raw as raw can be. All right? So, let's move on. I received the package yesterday. Now, funny upon receiving the package, they sent me tracking numbers. Notice I say tracking numbers. They sent me two tracking numbers, one from UPS and one from USPS. And I'm going to myself, well, which one is it? 
but when I posted my information out there for people to to know about, which is my friends, far away friends, and people in the community, they have some of them, many of them, as a matter of fact, have reassured me that it has happened before. So I was okay for it. For me, however, it's never happened before. It's the first time for everything, I guess. Okay. So yesterday, um, after the two tracking number situations, I don't know which way it's coming from. I, I mean, I could open up the box and probably find that I was thinking that maybe they didn't send me the right package. Okay. But they did. So it came yesterday at about 7 p.m. UPS delivered it. I was here to receive it. They rang my bell. And upon that, you know, Disney is also comical with how they're doing shipping. I mean, they pay, you know, you're paying good money for shipping. But at the same time, they're giving you a monster of a box. And this is the box that the one cup came in. Okay. This is the box it came in. Now, I was going to do the unboxing online, but, I, you know, I wanted to talk to you first. But I wanted to eyeball it first as well. Okay. There are reasons. Okay. And I'm going to have a good source of information for you at the end of this video that what you should do. Because I usually try it. Now, I couldn't do it now because it's only available Monday through Friday. That's okay. I will be calling Monday. No problem. So I opened up the box. Um, the box, you know, the cup was shaking a little bit, and that's fine. It seemed to have had some wrapping paper in it, and that's fine. And I've pictured opening the box and seeing the wonderful Shop Disney character blue tissue paper. That's rightfully so, right? That's Disney's way, right? When you open it up, it's supposed to be a beautiful... To me, it would be a beautiful presentation. I kind of look forward to this, folks. I'll be honest with you. So when I crack the box open, there was no tissue paper. But these things. Okay? I wanted my packing slip. Now, usually they pack a packing slip. I'm searching through the box for a packing slip. There's no packing slip. So it was stuffed with these and no packing slip and a gigantic box and, um, you know, the, um, a paper for, you know, the advertisement paper for the new, you know, the Disney credit card, which I already own. So we could just forget that. So it was also, here it is in the bottom of the box. It was sealed shut in this kind of paper. And I present to you the Starbucks Haunted Mansion tumbler it is gorgeous it is i'll give you that sleek design colors are vibrant haunted mansion logo turn it around the starbucks logo it's awesome i will uh say one thing that i did notice you know uh, that's why i like to eyeball things uh for myself sometimes i like to have a moment on my own and <laughs> one of the things I did notice is that it has a slight, it, it's in the paint though. It's in the paint. I'll give you that. And am I nitpicking? Yeah, yeah. For the price I paid for it. And there's a very good reason why I'm going to say for the price I paid for it right there, right above my finger. See it? There it is. Okay. I spot everything a mile away, folks. That's just what I do. But other than that, the cup is good. I'm worried about it, um, like uh, scratching, or whatever, because you know what? Again, when I buy something, I do not buy it not to use it. Years ago, I would have probably set it on display and did everything, but you know what? I am not the same Disney fan I was 10 years ago, okay? You now know this. So I will be using this cup. This cup is gonna go good with the Haunted Mansion purse the Haunted Mansion crossbody bag that I purchased from Hot Topic last year. It's going to, it's going to go good with that. So unless I, you know, start to use it now, which I probably will. So it, it is, it's nice. It is nice. I like the colors. So it's the color of the, you know, I say uniforms. Um, being that that is it, it is a metal cup. Let's open it up. It gives you the metal inside. You know, it gives you the paperwork for the, you know, how to clean it, you know, how to clean it, how to take care of it. And that's fine. It gives you the straw, you know, the straw is a good, um, heavy plastic straw. I like the fact that it has the protection on the bottom. So this way, 
you can't pull it out of the cup and lose it, which is always a good thing. And by the way, they do sell these straws down at Disney. I don't know if it's Disneyland, but they do sell them at Disney World at the Starbucks place. I believe they're $2.99 a pack. I think you only get one, but you know what? It's pretty good to use because everybody's been complaining about the paper straws. I get it. I hate the paper straws. So it's very good for that. Clothes is easy. It seals very nice. I'm just worried about scratches, you know, if there's any scratches, but it will be used, definitely. So we are halfway to Halloween, folks. Jazz hands. Uh, yeah, we're halfway to Halloween, and that's probably why Disney did it. Okay, Disney also is comical because what had happened is three days later, they now send me the package. I get the tracking numbers. Okay, everything's fine. I then go on Shop Disney because what it is is that I also get emails from them and text messages when there are sales and everything. Yeah, that's how heavily registered I am, even though I don't buy anything. I still keep up with it. Um, all the Haunted Mansion stuff happens to be in the category also of 25% off. So this cup was basically, after the fact, it became 25% off. Now, if you, you don't get some sort of anger from that, I was pissed. I was pissed. Anyway, the cup is here. It's good. It's in good condition. Gigantic box. No tissue paper. I'm weighing the options. UPS, USPS. It came UPS, so that's pretty good. However, I wanted to call Shop Disney today because, and you guys could do this. I'm going to suggest if you want to do this, feel free to do this. I'm going to give you the information. Uh, if you bought it on Shop Disney, Disney Store, Shop Disney, whatever the case, I'm going to give you the phone number. It is 1-800-328-0368. Monday through Friday, they're open. I already called, and there's no cast members available on the weekends. For, for a store, for Shop Disney, there are no cast members available. Years ago, they were open almost like 24 hours, 24-7. You can always get somebody, but see the way this company is. And I'm going to keep throwing digs. I'm sorry. That's how I am. 1-800-328-0368 is the Shop Disney, a.k.a. Disney Store phone number. They are available Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to call them on Monday, and I would like to request if they still do it, because I know a lot of places do. I want a uh, price adjustment. The 25% is still happening, by the way. 25% off is still happening. So while that is still happening, I only ordered this cup on July 14th. After the fact, the cup became on sale for 25% off. That's like $33, folks, for a cup. That is now $44.99. So everybody that paid full price should actually give it a shot and call the phone number. I'm going to call them on Monday. I already took the liberty of calling. This is why I got all the information that they're not open available, right? There's no cast members available. I cannot believe there's no cast members available on the weekends for Shop Disney. But I guess then again, this is how they're working, okay? Another, another reason for me not to like this company, so... Anyway, one more time, the phone number for Shop Disney, a.k.a. Disney Store, is 1-800-328-0368. Available Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. You know, I would try it. I would give them a call. Now, um, speaking about the insurance company in which I, this reminds me of calling people. The insurance company that um, is the third-party insurance that works through Disney, I had contacted them. They had sent me paperwork to see if I could start um, claiming the $165 in which they think that they're going to keep. If they keep it, that's fine, but, um, you know, it's worth a shot to fight for it. You know, as, uh, let me recap, I canceled my Disney trip for September. The down payment was $200 for Disney, but I always get the insurance for $165, so that was $365. I already received back my $200 from Disney, but of course Disney says, you know, that's a third party. That's not on us. That's on them. You're going to have to do something about them. So Disney refers to you these things. Disney allows you to attach the third party stuff, but then when it comes time to really come down to it, they don't want to know nothing. Okay. So I contacted the insurance company. They sent me the claim form. I just sent them back the claim form. They sent me the email stating that they are going to review the case and see what happens from them. So I will keep you posted on that. But you know what? Anything is worth a shot to fight for. I don't believe in just sitting around and just letting people keep 
things, you know, if they want to keep them, that's on them, but they're going to have to give me a God, a, a, a friggin' good reason, excuse my mouth, a friggin' good reason as to why they want to keep my $165. I did not go on the trip. I canceled the trip. Why are you going to keep my money? It's like I'm handing you $165 for absolutely nothing. That to me is totally outrageous. I'm sorry, but it's worth a shot to fight for. And I am, I am out to fight. And this is what I do. This is what I do. So I'll let you know on that in the process. But anyhow, the cup is here. It's fine. Hopefully you guys receive your cups. Let me know your reviews and everything on how you like it. It's a, it's a, it's a good cup. It will be used. It will be used. And it's going to go good with my Haunted Mansion bag and my little Haunted Mansion collection because I've been collecting little things, you know, lounge flies and everything over the years of Haunted Mansion. You see what I got. So it's a, it's a nice little addition. All right. But for $44, I will fight on that also. <laughs> It's just what I do, folks. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to continue my tea here in my Tiana cup. I bought a Tiana cup last week from Box Lunch. This is my Tiana's Place cup. It's a gorgeous cup. I don't know if I did. I did a review on it. It's a good cup. I paid $16.95 for it. Not bad. Anyhow, thank you so much for watching. God bless you. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and listening to me and my little rantings and ravings, but it is who I am. Okay. Um, if anything during the day pops up, so will I. Thank you, everybody. And I'll let you know if I go out or whatever. So let's see what the day brings. I don't want to, I don't want to sit home. I don't want to do that. <laughs> Anyhow, love to all. Have a great day. Talk to you soon, everybody.